In this video, I will demonstrate the navigation of the main menus page. The first icon I will be covering will be the protections menu. If your trip unit is equipped with dual settings functionality, you will have the options for both A and B settings. For the purpose of this demonstration, we will be programming settings A. Under protections, settings A, you will find the basic power distribution protection functions, such as your L, S, I, and G protections. Now let's move on to the advanced icon. Again, choose set A. Under advanced, you will find your more advanced protections functions, such as your voltage and frequency protections. In addition, you will find your second eye protection, which can be used for arc flash mitigation. The next icon I will be covering is the settings icon. In this menu, you can update the parameters of your circuit breaker to match your system. For example, you can change your frequency and phase sequence to match the application that it is being used in. Also, you can find the settings for additional modules such as communications. Moving on to the measurements icon. The first selection is historicals. This is where you can find the historical details about your breaker, such as the trip history. Within this selection, you can find the details about the last 30 trips that have occurred. In addition, you have an event log, which stores the last 200 events that have occurred within your circuit breaker, such as the parameters being changed or losing auxiliary power. You can also access historical measurements, which will provide the min and max measurements over the time of use. And lastly, I will cover the maintenance page, which will provide you with service details, such as contact wear, when the breaker was installed, and the last maintenance date. Next to settings is the test icon. In order to enter the test menu, you must enter your password, which is required when making changes to the parameters of the circuit breaker. The factory default password is four zeros and a one. Once you have accessed the menu, you now have the ability to perform tests of the LEDs, the display, execute a trip test, and also test the outputs for your signaling modules. Last is the About menu. In this menu, you can find detailed information about the circuit breaker, such as the, the type of trip unit installed, its current software version, as well as the date and time programmed in the breaker. Under the circuit breaker menu, you can see information about your circuit breaker configuration, such as CB name, serial number, rated current, and the pole configuration, as well as the circuit breaker status and number of operations under power. In the feature collection menu, you are able to see a full list of functionality within your circuit breaker and its current status. Finally, in your modules, you are able to see a full list of the additional modules that have been currently installed on your circuit breaker, such as signaling modules, communications, and measuring. 